Hey y'all, happy Monday. Today Ryan actually has the day off because it is Veterans Day. So I wanted to say a quick thank you to everyone who is currently serving or who has served this country because y'all are very, very much appreciated. Last night I actually came back from Orlando. I went to do some graduation photos and just see all my friends and it was a really great week. But I'm happy to be back in Austin. This is going to be a super freaking busy week. And I'm actually going to do a work week in my life, I think. So look out for that after this vlog. Um, because it's just going to be it's going to be a wild week. Yesterday I was planning out my content calendar for the week. And like seeing what I'm going to film. Seeing what, what I'm going to post. And all that. Like submit stuff. Um, and I felt a zip popping up. I'm not really sure if it's like my period coming in literally two days or if I was just like getting a little stressed and like I don't really get acne that much but when it comes to my period coming it just I don't know like something pops up and I'm just like why why my skin was doing so great until my period came along speaking of periods I have some products to share with you guys but before that I'm actually going to get you off this cup that you're balancing on and put you on a real tripod today's sponsor for this vlog is Rael and they sell organic pads and tampons growing up I would only use pads and sometimes I would get made fun of but I literally don't know why just because everyone has their own preference some people are more comfortable with tampons and people like me are more comfortable with pads the great thing about this company is that they have both obviously and they have a lot of different varieties of the pads and tampons they have panty liner pads petite pads regular large and overnight pads and then for the tampons they have regular and super i think when i was younger i was just intimidated by tampons i feel like pads are just easier in my opinion but now for the first one to two days of my period i'll use tampons I actually tried out this brand during my last cycle and I was my first time using organic on pads. I never tried it before, but I could tell a difference because the only thing that I ever hate about wearing pads is that it's kind of itchy. But with these pads, I actually saw a difference because you can feel that it's just breathable. It's definitely softer than normal pads. Um, and if you feel comfortable, you can wear them for a little bit longer because they don't create irritation. I honestly don't really know why I haven't used organic pads sooner. I feel like when I go buy pads, I just, you know, see the brand that I've seen on all of the ads and I don't think twice about looking at the ingredients. And what's scary is that the government doesn't even require these companies to disclose what ingredients are in these pads and tampons. So it's really important to know what is going around and especially in your body. So I urge you guys to do a little bit of research um, and check out these pads and tampons. I'll have a link in the description below to check these out and get some for yourself. It's beginning to look a lot like this. Thank you. Good? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so cute. Mm. Look at this. No, not you. A wrapper. What does it say, babe? <laughs> Ryan got one of those red cups and it said, like, whatever. No, it says. <laughs> it said, like, That's this. Anyways, I was like, what the frick does it say? It just says Merry Coffee, right? Mm -hmm. We are on our way to the San Marcos outlet. We didn't really have much to do today and we've been wanting to come here for a while now. So we thought it would be a perfect day. It's kind of rainy outside. Not rainy, but just like really gross and gray. I need to get a real good jacket. And my mom keeps saying that I have a billion jackets at home, but it's just like, none of them are really just like nice and like real good jackets if that makes sense they're all from like just like online stores that don't really keep me warm they're just like for show kind of like for fashion um so i definitely want to see if they have any really good like thick jackets because i'm very sensitive to the cold i have realized um and it's gonna get really cold here in austin i just I, what it's gonna be 31 degrees today 31 <laughs> Oh no, it's 74 right now. How does it drop that fast in a day? That's crazy. It's cold from a different milk on Oh no. Um, yeah, so I definitely need a jacket then. Y'all would be so proud of me. I haven't been shopping in so long. I actually bought like boots and I splurged on some really nice boots I need to show you guys. Um, but I haven't been shopping for like clothes and I've been re-wearing my clothes and I'm just so proud of myself. I know that sounds really dumb to you guys because y'all are like, what do you mean like clothes are there to re-wear? But 
especially for like Instagram I'm just I always tried to get like new clothes and like you know spice it up on the Instagram but now I like don't really care as much so that's good I told Ryan this this morning but my birthday is actually November 25th and I was trying to think of like what I wanted and he was like obsessing over these Bose headphones for a while and I was like, you know what? I kind of need like headphones. Like I have these like Sony ones that were like $50, super affordable and they were like noise canceling but I was on the airplane last night and I turned the noise canceling on and it was like not doing anything. So I was just like, maybe I should get headphones cause like I'm gonna use them like for editing and like now that I'm going to coffee shops more like it will definitely be handy and useful. So we'll see if I get them today cause there is like an outlet, I don't know. I doubt it's gonna be like a like crazy a discount. In, like, yeah, Nike what the heck? Right this is crazy. I feel like we're gonna spend so many hours here. Wait, I need to like empty out my purse because it's gonna be so heavy. While she was gone, I have been relaxing <laughs> and eating good food. What good food did you eat without me? I had Panda Express. Ew, that is so gross. I had Taco Truck twice. Boy. Does it not get tiring? No. <laughs> All right, y'all. Here we go. Wish me luck. Hopefully, they have a good sale. I like the silver or the white better than the black. I don't. I feel like then it's just like too like showy, you know. Yeah, I guess. But I don't know. I can like hear them yelling. Like, <laughs> Yeah. We are talking really loud, but like, I feel like I shouldn't have heard that. Yeah, in the Apple store, it went like completely silent, like almost like... What? In the Apple store, the AirPods were like oh, completely yeah, silent. AirPods are noise canceling, but AirPods do not fit in my dang ears. You really so had different sizes now. It. I know, but I just... I don't think like, I'm an AirPods girl. So we're not even like halfway through the stores. <laughs> we're just kind of popping in, popping out into all these stores. They have like a good selection of stores coming up on... Lululemon, so that should be good. Um, and what else? It's Armani suit. You gotta go in there. You know Armani runs an Oracle. Wait, what? Armani oh. runs an Oracle. Your software? Yeah, our software <laughs> is like. Uh, once I came to see it, the reflection. Big software guy. <laughs> and, uh, Does it actually curve like this? Huh? Has like a women's fit. I think it fits better. You like it? Yeah, we can outdoorsy girl. I feel like one. Look how warm you are, wow. <laughs> so I walked around at the outlet malls with a new pair of boots on that hadn't broken in yet. <laughs> I'd worn them a little bit, but I hadn't worn them with like athletic socks. I thought that would help like, stretch them out a little. Yeah. But I think I just needed to wear dress socks because they're like silkier and like kind of have no friction. Yeah. And they're actually like leaking, I think. <laughs> Literally, he was they complaining hurt so the bad. whole time. Couldn't even walk upstairs. Yeah, he was walking so slow and it was so cold outside, so I was like getting so mad. We stopped hiking. by home to get, yeah, a jacket for him and then new shoes <laughs> and then my beanie and we're gonna go to the 360 bridge it's kind of like drizzling a little bit but like whatever the sun's gonna set in an hour so i just thought like might as well take advantage of you know it being light outside so we're gonna do that and then maybe get ramen afterwards we'll see so plans have changed it is kind of rainy and um the 360 bridge turned out to be like 30 minutes away which i don't think it usually is it's just like kind of like traffic time it's almost five um so we were kind of like passing the yeti store and i was like we still have not done that so we're gonna do that kind of like walk through see what's up and just kind of like waste time until we're hungry <laughs> So we finished up at the Yeti store. It didn't take us that long because I guess it what like there wasn't that much to do in there. I really thought it was gonna be like more just like I don't know. I don't know what I thought, but everyone was just like, oh my god, you have to check out the Yeti store. So on the way out, a lady stopped us and was like, Can I interview you? I'm a interviewer or something. <laughs> Freelance feelings. journalist. Yeah. And she asked us about Yeti and yeah. like where we're from and stuff. Check your local publications, we might be famous. <laughs> <laughs> 
Tommy but be in Austin, I'm yeah, I'm kidding. But um, we just got to Ramatatsuya, and is this your first time here? Mm -hmm. mm, it's so yummy. Marisa took me here once, and she showed me the ropes. So hopefully, I remember like what she got because we split a ramen bowl. So I'll just text her and ask her. Yeah, I could probably text her. Yeah, I guess so. So, unfortunately, I totally, like, did not even realize that everyone would want ramen today. So there was, like, a big, big line out there. So we just came across the street to, what's it called? Del Bruto. So we're going to get some Italian food, which is fine with me because I was actually craving pasta before I was craving ramen. So this works out. We are home for the night. It's currently 7 p.m. She just ate dinner and she's trying to lick my face. But I'm gonna go take my makeup off, so that means I'm gonna end the vlog right here. If you guys are interested in finding out more about Rael and just organic cotton pads and tampons in general, there will be a link in my description box so you guys can read all about it and look at all their products for your next cycle. I will see y'all at my next video. Bye!